Welcome back to the Marlins franchise. Here on the show, we're going to make a trade to the Orioles for Nick Vincent for J.P. Howell and a minor leaguer. And we are going to uh, get a good righty with a 1.93 ERA on the season. Doing spectacular for the Orioles. Now we're going to be at Philly in the town of Brotherly Love Citizen Bank Park. The fake against the 20 and 34 Phillies as we are 33 and 19 leading the East. Vince Velasquez is 3-4 with a 2.89 ERA, really leading the Phillies offense, well, pitching-wise, uh, as they have a losing record, and will hope to give the Phillies a win again today, as he will hope to improve 4-4 four four on the year. Now, for the Marlins on the other side, it's Tyler Skaggs, 5-0 with a 2.38 ERA, looking for another win, hoping not to get a loss in that lose uh, loss column, as he hopes to be, quote hopefully, perfect all year as this lefty from Anaheim was spectacular throughout these first couple starts. Now, D. Gordon will lead off the game with a 3-2 count. He'll hit this the deep right center field. Old Dubo Herrera is looking up, and that is going to be gone into the Phillies bullpen. And it was a wall scraper. D. Gordon with a leadoff home run gives the Marlins a 1-0 lead. Now, base is loaded to us in the inning for Miguel Rojas. He'll hit this into left center field. The left, fielder's left fielder dives, and he misses it. Runner running third will be rounding home, and Rojas will try to make his way to third. But three run score is a 4 0 early Marlin lead now in the bottom half of the inning. High and deep to left field, and that's going to get off the wall. Jack Bradley Jr. plays it wrong. He's going to field it, and the runner from second is going to score. It's a 4 1 game as the Phillies try to come back here early. Now in the bottom of the third, Odubel Herrera up 3 2 count. Here comes. The pitch from Tyler Skaggs. And Herrera will hit this the deep right field. Stanton looking up, leaping at the wall. That is going to be gone. And Odubel Herrera gives the Phillies a 4 2, uh, two run difference, actually. Now, on top of the sixth, runner on first, Gordon. He is, he is speedy. Here's Yelich. He's running on the play. He'll hit this into the gap. Gordon, no doubt, will score as Yelich is going to round first, make his way to second, fourth, a RBI double. Marlins lead 5-2 to two with a three-run lead. Now on the bottom of the six, their catcher, Fernando Alad, I forget, but he let this the deep right field, and the run young rookie looking up, gone! Home run for the rookie, and the Simpson, uh, I mean the Phillies try to come back here, 5-3. Runs on the second and third for Roja, I mean, Tellis. And he'll drop in for a base hit. Is going to be a 6-3 ball game now in the Marlins' favor. Now on the top, uh, Tyler Skaggs up now next. And he'll hit this to center field. And he'll drop for a base hit, giving himself some insurance. Rounding second is the batter, and he'll score. And it is a 7-3 lead for the Marlins. Now here is Skaggs 101, 101, one second, 100 and second pitch on the even is a base is loaded, and now it's gonna go into the gap. Runner, one run scores, another one scores. The third run, rounding third, he's gonna make his way home, and he's gonna score a bases clearing double for the hitter, and it is a 7-6 ball game. Now here comes the manager. Yes, seen enough after Skaggs gives up that bases clearing double a. Overall good at it, except that inning right there. Here comes Furbush, 3, even ERA on the year with 16 appearances, 0-2. Doing pretty well, but that ERA should drop. Now he has to face Franco, and he'll pop this up to right field. Stanton will get under it, and he will make the catch to get out of the hectic inning. Top of the 8th, Stanton leading off, and he answers with a beat ball hidden deep left center field. That will be instantly gone. And Stanton gives the Marlins a 8-6 lead. Runners on the corners for Martin Prado. He'll hit this. And it's going to be a double play ball. But the runner will score. So it is going to be a 9-6 lead. Here comes Gerard Dyson pitching. Hitting for Furbush. As we got him from free agency. Well, here is the first pitch. He'll see as a Marlin. And he'll hit this. Oh boy. Deep and gone. Stan, uh, D Dyson, not known for power, but that is gone. 10-6, Marlins. Osuna making his first appearance for us. Not, I mean, not first, but excuse me. Runners on the corners, and a fly ball to center field. Yelich will make the catch. A hectic game in Philadelphia. The Marlins take it 10-6, to 
as Skaggs gets his sixth win on the year. Vlaska's uh, downgrading to three and five. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.